Where the trillionaires, man? What it do with y'all? Welcome back to another video, man. And look, man, this is a message to all the young people out here, man. You see, to all my young people out here, man, it's very important for you to win. Real talk, it's very important for you to win. So what do I mean by that, man? You see, this is something I just realized like a couple weeks back. And basically, people are looking at young people like they don't know what they're doing in life. People are looking at young people like, you know, since they are young, they, they don't have they don't have wisdom. They don't have knowledge. They don't have the right finances. You see, Basically, what I'm saying is they are belittling young people just because that they are young. When in reality, I'm a young individual. So basically, I have knowledge. I got wisdom. Real talk. I know I know certain things, certain topics. I know how important money is. You know what I'm saying? I know um, it's a whole lot of things. Real talk. It's a, it's a whole lot of things. But since just because I'm young or some shit, they think that you don't know. You see, look, this is this is why I'm this is why I'm gearing this message to the young people, man, because it's important for us to win. It's important, it's it's important for us to stun on these on these old MFs. I'm telling you what it is, it's important for that. Because real it, because real talk, because like I just told you, that's how they are looking at you. They're looking at you like you don't know what you're doing. Real talk. So like I'm, I'm the perfect example of a young success. Real talk. I tell, I, I tell myself every single day I'm winning, and best believe I am, because this is what I gotta do, and this is what this is what it is. You gotta do. You see, I made, I made, I made a similar video to this. It was titled "You Are Under Surveillance." You know what I'm saying? Because best believe, best believe they're watching you, and best believe they're watching young people the most. You see, these old these old MFs are afraid of the young people, and the reason for it being is because. Young people have more time on their hands to do what it is that they got to do. These old, these old people, they don't have too much time. They, they about to, they about to do where that rhymes with time. <laughs> they, I'm, I'm just telling you what it is. So they looking at you like you in your twenties or you, you in your late teens or something like that. Real talk. The, 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 um, the younger you are, then the, then the greater you're going to be listening to this video or realizing that time is the greatest thing that you could have because you got time. You a young person, you got time. Real talk. So they looking at you and they trying to see if you're going to be, if you're going to make it to the top, if you're going to, if you're going to exceed what it is that they, that they, that they think that, you know, they see your, they see your potential. I, that's what it is I want to say. They see your potential, but they don't want you to reach your potential. And that's the thing. Real talk. I'm telling you what it is. You see, there's something called generational curse. Real talk. There's something called that. And what the gen, what a generational curse is, is basically the previous generation and the previous generation. So the previous generation is going to put a, is going to put the curse of being a loser, being average in you. And that's exactly what it is that they're doing to you. But before, before, before they did it to you, they got the same treatment that they are doing to you from the other generation, from the generation before them and the generation before them and the generation before them. You see real talk. I could title this video generation. I, I might. I don't know yet. But but that's that's what's going on. So what I'm, I'll never forget this picture, right? I'll never forget this picture. And basically, what this picture was, it, it was a young kid, and he had he had like wings on him. It was like butterfly wings. And what that represented was, it represented that you know he had, he had creativity, dream. He had a purpose and passion to like do whatever it is that he wanted to do in life. But then. It was two adults in the back of him, right? You should know who it is. But it was two adults in the back of it, and they cut the wings off. And that's basically that's 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 literally the best imagery for a generational curse. And that's how all of us stay stuck. You stay stuck because you know what I'm saying. You you wanna you're gonna be taught how to be average. You're gonna be surrounded by people that's average. You know what I'm saying? You're gonna you're gonna listen to what losers or listen to what average you're going to view average and losing what people what you're going to you're going to view every single every single day is trying is, is attacking you to be a loser and be average just what it is so and that's that's i'm telling you man that's the generational curse out this bitch real talk and that's 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 <laughs> it's just that's how that's how the young that's how the people in the new generation are going to get affected and then from our generation right you know what I'm saying? That you know, here you go. Now you know, like uh, few, a few years, a few decades down the line, you're gonna be of the old generation. So you're gonna you're gonna tell the new generation 
what you've been brought up to, what you what you've been what you've been accustomed to. Now you're gonna cut their wings off. <laughs> Real talk. So, but all I'm saying is this is why this is important for all the young people watching this because it's important for you to break that generational curse. That that I I broke mine. I might be the first person. I might be the first person in my bloodline to ever do this. Real talk. I, man, real talk, man. It's just like, it just, man, it just, it, it just being being average is being average is a disease, bro. <laughs> I'm telling you what it is. I, 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 it just, and the crazy thing about it is, it's so easy to creep up on you. You know what I'm saying? What, real talk, losing could easily. You see, and that's 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 the reason as to why 99 percent of the population is losing because it's so easy to lose. I'm telling you, I'm telling you what it is. It's so easy to do that. You know what I'm saying? So, so the habits that you got may be losing. On top of that, like I said, you're around individuals who's losing. Then on top of that, you got your own mindset that's telling you you losing. Then on top of that, you got other individuals' mindsets. They're losing. So and you're around them. So all I'm saying is, you know, you're gonna you're gonna feed off their energy. On top of that, they're gonna give you what it is that they think is correct. And they're losing. So they're gonna tell you. Losing things, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So they might tell you, let's say, like I said, with that imagery, you know what I'm saying? Your wings gonna get cut off. I'm telling you what it is. You, you surround it. You surround it by people who are losing. You know, hi, hi, a loser can't achieve their dreams. <laughs> the fuck, a loser can't. A loser, I'm telling you what it is. You know what I'm saying? So they gonna tell you, oh, that's not possible. Oh, you can't do it. Oh, you're just gonna be an average. You're just gonna live an average life, man. You know, you're probably just gonna make a, you know, a, a, a average salary. You know what I'm saying? You're just gonna be average, you know. Welcome to the team. <laughs> now I'm, I'm telling you what it that's basically what it is that they're saying. And that's that's what I'm saying, man. And like I said, I told you, they're looking at young people the most. I told like I said before, so here you go, you're a young person with a dream, right? You wanna know how they you wanna know how the old heads looking at you when you you when you're a young person with a dream? It's two things. You see, look, man, <laughs> I always speak about this, but I'm just gonna keep it 100. Real talk, man. You see, when you're young, like I said, when you're young, you haven't you haven't been through life yet. That's that's one of the reasons as to why they look at you like when you when you say you have a dream, right? When you say you want to be rich and successful, you you just got a dream, you know. That when when you young, when you like in your early twenties or you know late teens, something like that, you know you want to know how they looking at you because they gonna look at you like they gonna they gonna look at you like um you still haven't experienced life, aka you still haven't experienced life to be to understand. To understand um, why being average is important to the adult. So basically, uh, you haven't had a job yet. You you haven't you haven't paid no bills or nothing like that. But you got a dream. <laughs> uh, you ain't gonna make that dream. That's exactly how they looking at you, young people. They looking. They, I'm telling you, that's how they look at us. But that's the reason as to why. That's the reason as to why I'm saying you got to break that generational curse. And that's the reason as to why I'm saying that you got you got to prove these MFs wrong. Because I'm telling you, man, and another thing, like I said it before, you, like I said, let's say you accomplish your dreams, right? Let's say you accomplish.